Well, hello, my fellow Ravens, Zabak here, and welcome to another video of our PG Mega MZ tutorials. This is going to be our last video for the tutorials. We have we are dealt into six videos of these tutorials to how to make a game of the basic. I'm going to go back into this once I'm done with my social series. I got like what? I say probably two more videos left for Sorcery 5 and then two more games for, which is Sorcery 6 and Sorcery 7. And, then, and once we come back to this, we'll go more deep detail of how to make a game for this new game engine. How to make it MZ. Me, I already know the way how it works, but you guys probably don't. Um, and that is actually our battle system. Like how it appeared to, it's brand new, I gotta say. Hey, because if you go to um, system one, there's a way of new battle system. This is a turn base, base or front view. There's also a side view and time pockets active or time pockets wait. Let's do time pockets wait. Hey. Which is actually, um, you wait for the character to go first, and then at, and then the enemy goes first, goes after that, and that sort of thing. So yeah, let's get that a try. We'll go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna get, I'm gonna make a brand new enemy. Let's say, yeah, brand new enemy. Hey, look, get rid of this and put this. Um, oh, same with this one to delete, and we'll put a brand new enemy for our crow. Um, for the crows, right? Yeah, a brand new enemy for the crows. Uh, yes, the call it because I did wrong. I actually did wrong. Yeah, okay, let me So one extra enemy like that and one extra enemy like that and and let's go to enemy with a brand new enemy let's let's put what's a good enemy for placing our clothes so this one Let's put two encounters. Hmm. I'm feeling in, we could do what's plasma? Okay, that looks pretty good. Salamander. Sandworm. Is that good for crows? Alright. Let's give it a let's give it a, a try. Sandworm. There you go. What's the crow level? It's 250. Okay. Just check it out on the health. And 50 but Okay. 50 for this one. 25 for the for the attack. 20 for each one and for all of them is oh 0 is 25 this is 20 and I see yeah let's try to put this on the back see a 10 and and with not much XP but we can work right there right. and that's it that's all it does Yep, alright. Then let's put it in. And there we go. Now we're gonna put on something original. So let's say we want to do. Wanna, let's move. Oh, yeah. Okay, I want to make sure I'm doing this right. You don't need that anymore. 
anymore. And we're going to delete. We're going to do something else. So let's say we want to put. Let's put new. And uh, world. Like that. We'll map to 20 by 20. I want to map to be too big. Fear one. And. and like that could work, yeah. And then we'll just put um, grass around it, around it. Let's put maybe a a square bit of lake. Not that. Maybe these, yeah, mountains and and uh, around this like that for for hills. Three D's for the trees. Same thing with same thing with this. Probably get us right. Totally right. There you go. Oh, and then maybe we we'll put it like like that. I don't want to. Make, I don't want to make it too go to it. Uh, it should look pretty well. How? Yeah, to it. So like this, like that, and let's put a town. Feeling that might be that might be good. What? It and then maybe and then finally we'll put a castle. Oh, for the, for our final one. When I come back to that, I'll put a way of how it works based on the ending of of their own game. Aim and there you go. So let's go ahead and test this out. Oh, I gotta say. Alright, so we're gonna put this in, in West mode. It says just going there. We got the world we're gonna go into the world. There you go. Oh, and this can actually move this to our world over here. Here and transfer this to our cave. Like that, delete this actually, and I think that's actually it. Once we put this as a town, just copy and paste that, paste that, and And we just and then we just put this our new pro and uh same room for uh, yeah. I'm just gonna put this as a battlefield for grassland and grassland. There you go. Save and starting. Okay, we put the time station to wait. For our battle system, so let's go give this a try for the first time.
based on how it works. Roll battle system. Turn pockets active and wait. It's like Fire Fantasy, but I think at this more like Fire Fantasy than wait. I gotta say, I'm not sure how that works based on new gen and old gen for those kind of games. But yeah, definitely just like Final Fantasy A for these two ways of battle system. Um, and that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna leave the video here. Here, and I'll come back to this once and done with the social series. Hey, to give you more info to how I make a game on these tutorials. Those plugins can be in last, like very last. I'm pretty sure in like a year or so we we'll get we we'll get more Dell into plugins. It's a brand new engine actually, so so I'm gonna work on plugins actually very last. As but it, that many there's that many plugins actually and it's kind of boring I gotta say so definitely indeed so. Oh, well, let's go work on next. Next, when I come back to this, is deep intel into events, um, creating new maps, new monsters, skills, skills, and so on, all the way into the plugins. This is actually the very last, and it's gonna be a pretty good Vion series for for going ways how to make a game if you don't know how to do it. And without further ado, I'm going to leave the video here, so thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to join C Raven. Do follow me on all my social media accounts, and I'll see you next time. Bye.